So for the Magpul D60 giveaway, there's my AR-15. Wait, what? No, that's not it. So this is my Smith & Wesson M&P 15 Optics Ready Semi-Automatic 5.56 millimeter rifle. And the barrel has a bore, gas key, bolt carrier, and chamber are all chromed. And the rifle features a 70-75 T6 aluminum receiver and a 4140 steel barrel. Uh, the rate of twist is 1 in 9 and the barrel length is 16 inches. The overall length is 35 inches and the weight is 6.5 pounds. I also, also, I, did I say asshole? I also have a Sightmark Ultra Dual Shot Pro Spec Night Vision Compatible Red Dot Sight. And the reticle type is a four pattern. Uh, battery type is CR1632. Battery life is 25 hours on high. Adjustable reticle brightness. Parallax corrected. Unlimited eye relief. Uh, adjustable quick detach weaver amount on the other side there. Water resistant and shock proof. And the retail price is $149 on that. It's not bad for a low price entry level uh, red dot sight. So that's what I went with. I also have Yankee Hill pop up deployable iron sights front and rear and I have a Magpul 6 position uh, collapsible stock and a Magpul uh, angled relief uh, foregrip and that's the front sight of the Yankee Hill machine uh, deployable pop-up front sights iron sights for backup there's my red dot sight and my backup uh, rear sight there. I also have an attachment here for a sling and uh, if you're in California you know what that is. And I also have a uh, you can see that, a BCM. It's kind of upside down in your viewer but that charging handle nice ambidextrous and on this other side I've also planned to do something with this cover plate here. Name my weapon. I've already named it Excalibur. And the uh, tactical flashlight uh, completes the whole image there for the AR. Pop up sights. Everything is. Uh, was done specifically for the build on this. Uh, I might replace this uh, quad rail with something like Daniel Defense, something really thinner and lighter. I just really uh, I don't like this quad rail. It's an aftermarket piece that just is really heavy. And uh, yeah, that's going to be next on this build. And needling? On the move. 